What is up everyone, Mr. Aviator here, bringing you another episode of That's Life here on Aviator Gaming. Now you guys probably thought this series was over when The Sims 4 came out, but hey, I'll let you know that's not happening. We have moved to The Sims 4. There's me as an older sim like I was in That's Life. I'm, I'm now Grandpa Aviator still, but looking a little bit hipster. And then here's my daughter, Ashley, who we lived with, and her child, who was a baby in That's Life, but now he is an actual child aviator ladder and he's going to be the guy that takes over the series eventually. So we're basically raising aviator to be the saving person of our family. Now you're probably wondering where's where's my wife and where's her husband? Well, they were both elders so we're going to pretend they died before I did and I'm, I'm still at lasting. Like we're we're taking this series to maybe two years into the future, three years into the future. That's why he's a child and my wife's dead and her husband's dead. But you guys, if you really want That's Life to continue, what I'm going to do is we're going to set a like goal. If we crush it, then we will continue to do That's Life here on The Sims 4. Let's go for 5,000 likes, you guys. So make sure you slap that like button. If we have 5,000 likes, we will continue this series, That's Life, a show a lot of you guys like. We'll continue into The Sims 4 with all the expansions and everything that come out. Um, okay, let's get started. Oh, also, don't forget to leave comments down below what you kind of like to see a uh, baby aviator or child aviator turn into and and just give me like stuff that we could do over the next few episodes yeah. okay this is the first that's life without a machinima that's really weird but hey there's gonna be one next time you know it. you know i'm gonna have a little skit that will weird all you guys out at the beginning of the next one okay so let's see uh so we just moved into this house this is our house it's a two bedroom uh it's got a living room slash kitchen and a nice little bathroom it's, it's a really nice house i actually use this on my channel aviator games now if you guys want more sims 4 content i upload one to three a uh, Sims 4 videos on Aviator Games every day. I'll link that channel down below if you want to go check it out. But okay, so let's see. Hmm. We're going to get this day started. I'm an old guy. I want to see if I can get a job. Oh, I can. Awesome. Because in The Sims 3, it made you retire. It, it was over for you. Uh, I want to be a tech guru because I know it makes a lot of money and I can help my family now. Starting at $31 an hour, that's pretty good. Uh, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to be a live chat support agent. Now, my daughter... She, uh, her lifelong goal is to be a soulmate to someone because she wants to meet her new husband. It's been a few years since her husband died. El Rigo! And uh, she wants to meet someone new. So we're going to have her find a job too, though, so we can continue to support the family. We do have $10,000 in the bank because we bought a really cheap house. As you can see, there's nothing great in this house. But let's see. So what does she want to be? So she wants to be a lover. As her lifelong goal, uh, she could be a writer, a secret agent. Tech Guru pays a lot. It pays the most, actually, in the game that I've seen so far. Look at Criminal, $9 an hour. 25 26 23 15 21 So it is the highest paying job that I see in the game right now. But an astronaut, now that would be pretty cool. And it's something I've never done. So we're going to have her try to be an astronaut. So it looks like she starts work tomorrow. And so do I as an old man. We're going to have to update this house a little bit, you guys. We're going to have to, we're going to, have to give this house a couple items. Let's get Ashley out of here. Let's just give this house a couple items that are going to be essential. So essential item number one, uh, television. We need a better TV than that. We're just going to change the couch up. Now this, I'm getting way better at The Sims, you guys, here. And I'm going to be able to cruise through this. So we're going to... We're gonna grab this. There we go. Now we need a TV stand. So we're gonna go to electronics. Now you guys know I'm all about that white furniture. We're gonna put that nice TV here. And this TV's 1400. This one's 2500. This one's pretty small. Uh, so we're gonna probably go for the $2500 TV. There we go. Now that's expensive. Now we do need a good computer. If I'm gonna be a tech genius or a tech guru or whatever, we do need a good computer and computer desk for me to practice all my stuff on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to surfaces. Now I think I'm gonna make this bedroom mine, um, and then this bedroom my do Ashley's and baby aviators. Or maybe me and Ashley. Me and Ashley can share this room for now. I don't know. We're gonna have to work something out. But let's see services. So now we need a computer desk. Uh, we're gonna go with like this nice little white desk. It's four hundred thirty dollars, but it looks pretty badass. Uh, we're gonna delete the dresser. We don't need that, and that saves us four hundred dollars. So let's put the computer right there. Now we need a computer chair. <laughs> okay. So this is just getting expensive. Uh, can we get this in white? We need a comfortable one because we're a tech guru. We're gonna be spending a ton of time on our computer. Now. There's a few computers we can choose from, and they get pretty expensive pretty fast. There's this one for 800 bucks, uh, but then there's this really good one for four grand. Now four grand though, that's that's pretty expensive. Uh, but otherwise, there's this one for 1400 dollars. Uh, I don't really see the big difference except in fun and reliability. Uh, are we willing to pay another 2600 for reliability? Well, we're going to be using it quite a bit, so why not? We're going to. 
So there we go, four grand. Now we're down to thirty-eight hundred dollars. What else could be changed? So this should be baby aviator's room or child aviator, I guess I should say. Uh, let's go like this. I actually like the way this room looks. Uh, I guess I need some toys. So let's see. I've never. Oh, here's kids. I've never been in this section yet. I haven't really had kids on this game. Pile of sports equipment. Well, that's cool. I like that. Okay, let's let's put the pile of sports equipment outside. That's where he's playing all of his sports and stuff. Uh, let's get him a Jolly Trolley antique replica. Well, he doesn't need an antique. Holy crap, those are expensive. Uh, where Where's a good toy? Are there any good toys? A lunchbox, a school staggery, a ladybug buddy, uh, a Gary the giraffe. <laughs> what is he going to use him for? Probably nothing, but hey, he's got a giraffe. Now we're not $200 on a giraffe. Baby genius mobile. Okay, okay. Well, the train's cool. A train caboose. So is this something he can even play with? $400, $400, and then a little coal, little coal engine. Okay, well, looks pretty. Oh, wait, can you connect these? Let's see, let's see. Oh, no, you can't. Okay, well, let's just, let's just get rid of that one. Let's put these little guys up here. Uh, and then a steamboat. This, this is all stuff he can look at or play with. I don't know. I'm not sure. Now, me and my daughter, we can sleep in the same bed for now. That's something we can work out in the future if she finds a boyfriend or a husband or somebody she eventually wants to marry. We'll work that out. Now, what I'm going to have my daughter do is since she wants to be an astronaut, let's see what she needs. Uh, enthuse about space with three sims. Okay. Uh, she can enthuse about space with myself. Uh, enthuse about space. And then with her son, she can enthuse about space. Unless she needs... Oh, enthuse about space. There we go. We're gonna, oh, and then this sim right here. Uh, this is Mortimer Goth. He is here. Let's introduce ourselves to Mortimer and see what he's all up to. Okay, so hello, Mortimer. Thanks for coming over, buddy. Friendly introduction. Go ahead. So she's enthused uh, about space to two sims. Now we're just trying to enthuse to Mortimer here. Okay, she already met this girl. Let's enthuse about space. Hey, just let you know. Oh, space. It's great. Enthuse about space. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Did she enthuse about space? No, she did not. Is she getting distracted about enthusing about space? Yes, she is. Enthuse about it. Enthuse about it. There we go. Okay. So now she just needs to get her performance up. Now let's check what I need. Uh, play video games for four hours. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to play Sims forever for a few hours. Now, you guys, let me go over the traits I gave my Sims. Uh, the traits. Where are the traits? Where are the traits? Where are the traits? Where are the traits? Oh, right here. Here it is. Simology. I'm outgoing, I'm a geek, I'm a genius, and I'm business savvy. Because my goal is to be very wealthy in life. Before I leave my family, before I die and they bury me, I want to be wealthy for them. Uh, I made Little Aviator a geek, because maybe he'll one day grow up to be a tech guru just like his grandfather. And then Ashley's outgoing, romantic, family oriented and very alluring because she wants to find a soulmate. So, I kind of like made Ashley more of the family girl that wants to... To make the best life she possibly can for her son. Now, it looks like Aviator's watching some television. Burning his mind out on television. We're going to have Ashley actually serve some quick... Oh, wait. She can't even serve a meal? Cook. Oh, she doesn't know how to cook. Okay. Well, this is going to be interesting. Grilled cheese. Let's have her make party size eight. So, let's have her make eight grilled cheese sandwiches. As I continue to game for four hours straight. What a chore. So we're one hour into our gaming binge marathon. It's getting pretty interesting. As you can see, we're playing Sims forever. And it looks like a pretty intense game. Not gonna lie, it looks like a mixture of Sims 1 and like Sims PlayStation 2. I don't know, it's kind of weird. I like it though. So we're gonna let him continue to play that. Two more hours he needs. It looks like he's increasing his gaming skill. I like all the random skills they offer on this. It's pretty freaking cool. Okay, so let's see. Oh, he can view that. He can't even play with it. What the hell? Why? Why would they make something like that that the kid can't even play with? Well, little aviator, I guess you can... Uh, oh, did your mom make the grilled cheese? She did. She did make the grilled cheese. Okay, so you can grab a serving of that. And we'll put the rest of that in there. Oh. Oh, open this and grab a serving. Okay, so we're level two in the video game. What is this? Grade school homework. Oh, God, you got to do your homework then. I didn't know that they would give you homework day one. Okay, so did we get our four hours played? Almost. We're almost there, guys. We're almost there. Then I know one thing that a tech guru really does need is programming skill. So after all this fun, we're going to have him program. And it looks like his bladder's pretty weak. He's pretty old. So we're going to have him use the toilet. And then that's about it. That's that's all he needs to do. But let's see if he gets the, He has the four hours. So once he's done on the toilet, we're going to have him practice programming. What are you doing on here? What are you, what are you doing? Okay, so she's getting up. 
It looks like she's gonna take the dishes in. Now she's gotta go to the bathroom. Now she's feeling flirty for some reason. Maybe we can go on the town and see if Ashley can meet a new suitor. Because her husband's dead, my my wife said, but I'm fine. I'm, I'm, I'm an elder. I'm fine with dying, you know, without a wife. You know, I had a few wives. Um, and, you know, I'm fine with going out with nothing. Like, I don't need a relationship. I'm, I'm really concerned with raising Aviator and, and Ashley still. Let's check in on Aviator. It looks like he's doing his homework. Come on, Aviator. You can do it. Bring the noise, son. He's a C student. He needs to get two skills to level four and attend school while energized. Wow. Now that is intense. Two skills to level four. What skills would those be? Look at all these skills he has. Uh, social, uh, motor, mental, and creativity. Creativity skill can be developed by the activity table and easel. Okay, okay. Mental skills be built on science table and ch chessboard. Okay, so we're going to need to go buy some stuff so Aviator can kind of upgrade his skills. So let's see. Kids activities. Uh... Junior Wizard starting set. What's this? Creativity Art Thou Activity Table. Okay, let's look at the activity table. Let's, uh... The activity table looks pretty interesting. Maybe we'll have him do his activities outside. That might be a, a good spot for him. Oh, oh, it's got it's one of those. Okay. And then we can have him do his little science projects outside too. Just to keep consistency. Uh, so we'll let him, we'll let him do both of those. Okay, so head back in. We gotta make sure he finishes homework, though. He can easily get social up to a level four. He's just talking and talking and talking. Uh, you embarrassed him, Mom! You embarrassed Aviator. Okay, so now draw. We're gonna have you draw shapes. So Aviator's gonna draw some shapes as Grandpa Me still uh, <laughs> programs away. Uh, acquires some charisma skill, creativity skill. Okay, perfect. Let's head back over to Aviator, see what he's up to. He's still kind of embarrassed. He's kind of taking it out with, uh, with drawing and everything. But we're trying to get his creativity to, what, a four he needs for each one? That is, that's pretty crazy. Uh, clean up. So clean that up. Draw shapes. Okay, so go ahead. Keep drawing shapes. It's going to be annoying if we have to keep, like, come on, draw, draw more, draw more. Now we're going to make sure Aviator's to bed by about 9.30 at night. We don't want him to stay up too late. He is still a young kid. We can't have him getting on a very bad sleeping schedule. Did you finish it? Did you finish the inventory? No, you didn't. You didn't finish the, the, the drawings? Oh, you did finish it. Okay, well, clean up then. Clean up. You, now, 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 don't forget to draw shapes again. <laughs> He's like, yay, keep drawing shapes. Okay, you're level two now. We'll let you quit for today. Uh, we'll have you use this. Take your brisk shower and then go to sleep, a little aviator. Now let's go check in on me. So it looks like I'm starving. I'm going to go to open and I'm going to eat some grilled cheese. Grab some of that. Put that in my mouth. And it's getting pretty late. So I'm going to go to sleep. No more programming for now. Got to give up on that. Programming, we got a level 2 skill. And we have a level 2 skill in video games. And one charisma skill. So everything's going pretty well. Now let's check in on uh, Ashley. So we're going to have Ashley take a brisk shower. And then we're going to have her sleep as well. Yes, she's going to sleep in the same bed as her dad, but nothing gross is going on with that. So she's taking a brisk shower to energize herself. Let's check, on, check in on baby aviator here. Did he get his homework done? Did he? Okay, he did. Awesome. So his performance should go up. Attend school with en with energi while energized. Okay, so in the morning, I'm going to have him quickly have a quick meal of cereal. And then I'm going to have him take a brisk shower. Oh, it looks like he has to go to the bathroom. Uh-oh. Once you're done, go back to sleep. Good job, Grandpa. Uh, then we'll have Grandpa take a brisk shower. And Grandpa can watch some cooking channel. Okay, so Aviator's gonna eat a quick bowl of cereal. Then we're gonna have him, have him take a brisk shower. So that way he's energized and excited for school. Uh, maybe we'll have him eat a quick yogurt as well. Keep keep that all up and up on tabs. There, he's energized. He's feeling great. There's nothing that can keep him down. And he's about interest with someone from being energized. <laughs> he's got so much he wants to do. Oh, embarrassing moment. Embarrassing moment for Grandpa Aviator as he goes in and sees his little grandson pooping himself. Uh, take a brisk shower. Go ahead, Grandpa. Look at that bladder. Look at that bladder go down. It's just like, you're going to pee your pants. Okay, what time is it? 
Six thirty. Okay, so the bus doesn't come till like eight. Or I mean, he doesn't leave school till eight. Okay, so Grandpa Aviator is gonna shower, or I guess Grandpa me. <laughs> I'm gonna shower. Oh, work comes for all of us. Oh, we all go to school and work at the same time. This is really good. Actually, I don't know if I do. Let's see. Let me quickly check. So I don't start till 10 a.m. So yeah, Ashley's gonna leave, and so is uh, Aviator. Let's check Ashley. Is she gonna get promoted today? Possibly if I work hard all day with Ashley, she could get a promotion today. Fingers crossed, because we need money. We don't have a lot of it. We do want to move out of this house eventually. This is just our starter home. Flirt with coworkers, work hard. We're gonna have her work really hard all day, and now we're gonna have Aviator study hard. We want them both working as hard as they can. Now Aviator's not gonna be able to get uh, a promotion through school until he until he gets his skills up, which is gonna take a little bit. Let's see, let's serve breakfast, scrambled eggs. I wanna really make some food that the family can eat on for a couple of days. Uh, it looks like I'm bored and I need some socialization. Uh oh, fire! Oh god, extinguish, do it! Do it, oh. Oh, our house started on fire, we get $220. We can replace that and replace that. That was a very expensive fire. We're going to have to... Wow, we are very upset. <laughs> we are very upset with ourselves. Let's check who we have on the phone that we could possibly get in touch with and just chat with. It looks like we don't know anyone. Retire from Tech Guru. Hire uh, job. Yeah, there's no one that we really know that we can call. Wow. <sighs> well, I guess we're going to have to resort to the internet. We're going to socialize and just uh, chat. Chat online. See if there's anyone we can kind of hook up with over the next couple of hours. Oh, wait, do I have to be at work? Do I have to be at work? Am I working today? Oh, today he's got off. Okay, so I don't even have to go to work today. We're just going to socialize on the internet for a little bit. Get get some people that we can possibly meet. Uh, then let's go to socialize again. I think there's find a pen pal. We should do that too. Uh, our social's up high enough. It looks like we're confident. We're very happy that we've, uh, we've posted for a pen pal too. Now we just got to wait on a reply. Now what we're going to do is program, and we're going to practice some programming. Get our programming skill up even further. We're going to use our days off to kind of get more successful, and that's Grandpa Aviator doesn't have a lot of time left in his life, so he's got to use all the time he has to be as successful as possible. We have 51 days until we potentially die. Oh, days live 51. Okay, that's how many we live, so we don't know how long we could live. We could live another 10 days. We could live another 100 days. Fingers crossed that we live a while. I sure hope so. Uh, so Aviator still at, or Ashley's still at work and Aviator's still at school. In about an hour, Aviator will be back home and we can focus on his homework and all that kind of stuff. Being a kid on this game and teenager, those are hard. That's hard work because they they basically have a ton of homework. Once you hit an A, once you hit an A, as long as you go to school and everything, you really don't have any homework. I guess you can like skip over it and the game really doesn't care. Uh, but look at this, Aviator's hungry. He's gonna is he eating? Eat, aviator, eat, and he's watching TV at the same time. So he's pretty bored. Let's change. Let's let's watch channel. Watch Kids Network. There we go. He's gonna watch some TV. He's having a good time. Look at him over there. Uh, now we're gonna have him use the toilet, and then he's got to do his homework to get those grades up. Look at his performance though. It's it's high. It's really high. So now he needs to get two skills to four though. But we have to have him do his homework to keep that up. Looks like Ashley did a good job. How come she didn't get promoted? Oh, so close. Okay, so we're going to have her open the fridge, grab some uh, grilled cheese or whatever the hell is in there, and then we're going to have her clean up the house because Grandpa Aviator's programming on the computer back here. Look at me. I'm focused, and I am just... I am going to pee my pants. That's how focused I am. I don't even notice when I'm about to pee myself. Okay, let's go use this. We're going to take a brisk shower to re-energize ourselves a little bit. We're in the zone. But we're also uncomfortable. We have to take that into account. So we're going to use the bathroom. Uh, and then we are going to just uh, let's share brilliant ideas. We're going to just chat. Chat with our daughter after this. And maybe we can start a good a good chat circle. Okay. You doing your homework, Aviator? Okay, it looks like he is. Now, Grandpa's joining the chat. Looks like everyone's having a good time here. Let's make sure our social's going up. And the home his homework is complete. So Aviator doesn't have any more homework for the night. What time is it? It is... Eh, it's not that bad. Let's watch, uh... Kids Network. So go ahead, Aviator. Go watch some Kids Network. Grandpa's gonna continue to talk with Mom. So let's see. Uh, tell an engaging story. We're gonna tell her an uh, engaging story again. Debate game strategy. Uh, do an impression. Okay. 
Let's get this. Let's get this happiness up. It looks like Aviator's going to bed. It is nine o'clock. Smart move, Aviator. Get your butt in the bed. And it looks like Grandpa's all alone tonight. Now he's got to go eat some of his. He's not going to tell Ashley that he started the house on fire today. That's probably a good move, not to say anything. And then he's going to go to sleep. He's embarrassed. They uh, maybe they found out he started the house on fire. <laughs> you know who knows. Uh, we're gonna have him take a brisk shower in the morning though, and then go straight to programming. A whole bunch of programming. Now, Aviator, we're gonna have him use the toilet, take a shower, and then go back to sleep because he'll be ready for school basically, and we'll have him have a quick meal of cereal. Good job, Aviator. You look happy. You look energized. I'm happy for you, bud. <laughs> but you guys, I think this is a good place to end the the first ever revamped. Sims 4 episode of New of That's Life Newlyweds of That's Life. If you guys want to continue, like I said, make sure you slap that like button. Leave a comment down below uh, if you watched the whole episode saying welcome back. Just say that. This is gonna be confusing for some people, but if you watch the whole episode, welcome back. Just say that, and I'll know you watch the whole thing. Until next time, remember, take it easy, live and squeezy. <laughs>